Alex and I are doing a little staycation in Beijing this weekend. All of this week is going to be happening in Beijing and we're starting it off right here. And look how big the bed is. It's massive. We're gonna go down to the lobby and enjoy a complimentary drink. They have a cool pool that we have to go check out and then let's stop by the restaurant and look at the menu so that I can think about it while I'm in the pool. Yeah. Excellent. Hi. We have a bath and a shower. We have all the options. We have so many options. Okay, let's go downstairs. I'm excited to come back to the room and put on the big fuzzy white robe and sit and get ready for dinner too. Yeah. For our welcome drinks. Yeah. Do you feel welcome? But I'll feel more welcome when I'm sitting in the pool. Mm -hmm. so we're gonna talk about the fact that the last time on the vlog, you were like, yo, recommend me a hotel rewards program. And then we didn't post that video, we just chose a hotel rewards program ourselves. <laughs> yeah, it was the one that I was asking about. Yeah, so it's, it's totally free. Oh. Um, and then I think there's like tiers based on how many nights you stay within a year. Mm -hmm. um, but I believe the first, you like you get enough points to do a free night. If we stay at like this quality of hotel-ish, mm -hmm. you get enough points to do a free night after four nights. Okay, that's pretty good. About four, maybe five, depending on exactly the price of the room. So that's good. for every four and maybe five nights, we get one free. Okay, cool. That's fine. Not that we like stay at hotels super often, but just when we do travel, it's nice. Yeah. And then I think if you stay 10 nights in a year, mm -hmm. then you like get bumped up a level. And then kind of, kind of for every 10 nights mm -hmm. past 20, it's like mm -hmm. you, you go up a level. And we got a, we got a welcome drink. That's yeah. why we got a welcome drink. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cute. Tea. At the pools in Beijing, you have to wear a swimming cap. Let's see your swimming cap, Alex. Yeah, you look so cute. I and thought you would look so cute in that pink swim cap with the little dinosaur on it. Yeah. So cute. Do I look nice in my swim cap? Yeah. Your swim cap, the, your hair is not in, but... I don't know the p purpose. All I know is I must wear my swim, swim cap. And I don't anticipate putting my head in the water. It's fine. Let's go for a swim. So pretty. I do really wish that these were open. It would be really pretty. Part of the allure. It was what they advertised online. It's not. Well, but this, but it is open to the, yeah, yeah, to yeah, the yeah. sky. Okay. We had a swim, and now it's time to get ready for dinner. We took some really funny pictures in our robes, which I'm very pleased about. And now I must get ready. I was also gonna look closer at the menu, but I looked at the menu, but not close enough. I don't have time. Go, 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 go. I bought these glasses on Taobao specifically for us to take around with us and use as kind of like photo props. Um, on first glance, could you tell how absolutely cheap and plastic they are? Or did I fool you? I'm not gonna like carry real glass around in my bag. I think they passed. I think they're cute. Currently it's water, but soon it will be wine. Well, yeah, I gotta try this wine, here. Mm. Alex bought this wine while he was away. Cheers. For 20 kwai, mm -hmm. which is $6, $4 for a bottle of wine. It looks cute though, so it looks like it has potential, but. We just need to make sure that it tastes okay. Cause... Give us the verdict. The well, yeah, and it, that's what it's supposed to be. You're not supposed to put red wine in that glass, yeah, but it'll have to do. I, need to take I think I could have a glass of this after we do din dinner. Maybe. Yeah. It's not that bad. I don't care for it. Mm, the aftertaste yep. is a bit... Yeah. But yep. the initial... Nope. You're not sure? I, I know. You know that you're not going to drink it? Yeah. Uh-oh. Just lagging. Ready to go? Ready for dinner. Here we go. Dun, 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 dun. Cute. Okay. Time for dinner. He's got the key. We're going to have dinner. I'm so excited. Taobao. Mar uh, market. Yeah, Lauren had this jacket made for me. Yeah. 
for my birthday in 2018. Yeah, I think so. No, that was the... But that was the, the brown jacket. jacket. I, I have this jacket. Right? But that this was also from... Same place. Same place, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This is the most perfect little spot right in the corner, this little like round booth so we can still kind of be beside each other. That's my favorite. <laughs> I'm so excited. This is the black cod and it comes with a calligraphy brush and I can use it to do. It's so cute. <gasps> Your steak. It looks good, yeah? Yes. You excited? Steak, sides. <gasps> what are you doing? Writing Chinese calligraphy on my piece of fish. Lauren, <laughs> what did you just discover? I'm sure it's wrong backwards. Oh no. You can't tell it from my drawer over them. Good thing the potato's covering them up. Good thing. That's a pocket from... Potato! Oh, no. We've come to the 798 Art District this afternoon. It is raining a little bit outside, but we're having a look around. We, this is how I always feel when you're here, is you kind of just have to like pick which exhibits you think you might like, and then just go in and see how they are, because I just never really know what I'm getting into. Yeah. Which one should I go for? Which one is this? I don't know. Maybe the rose tea? A tea. Maybe a rose tea. Maybe. Yeah. I guess maybe I should go to the store. But I've been wanting to come to this place for a long time. It looks really cute. Do you want to come? It's so cute. Okay, I'll give it a story. I'll give it a story. been wanting to come to this restaurant for a long time and we tried to come one day but it was closed they were like hosting an event so I'm really glad we finally came to try it out this is bon Botanica Botanica now the question for the vlog is are we gonna go and try the new coffee that's at Lucking Coffee the special promotion this month which is coffee and baijiu which is a Chinese hard liquor Everyone I've ever seen try it says it's gross. But I think that's the whole point of the promotion is they're just like advertising the liquor and that you just have to try it and try it and it's gonna be gross. I think we might have to try it. it just, to, just to say that we did it. There it is. That's the big promotion. I've seen it all over social media, everywhere. I think we just have to try it, just to say that we did it. Is it sold out? Uh, I don't know. I think it might be sold out. Maybe we'll find another Lucky Coffee around. They're everywhere. Yeah. Okay, hope to find that one. Cool. This is another coffee store that we've seen popping up everywhere. There's been a lot of new locations of that in, I think we were in two different malls that had locations that were just opening. So it seems like it's gonna be very popular. They were sold out, so now we're on a mission. Now we have to find a Luckin coffee that isn't sold out to try it. Maybe they do that on purpose and they only have a limited quantities to make it difficult to get. Also because it's just gross. Have you ever had Baijiu just like on its own? Like or mixed, like a mixed drink? Have you ever tried it? I think I have. I think I've had like a sip of it yeah. once and just went, oh, like nope. gross. 
Yeah. yeah. Like just like mixing vodka. Like you're like, yeah. Imagine it with coffee. Also, the minute I step outside, I get all the mosquito bites. Tis the season for the mosquitoes. And they love me. And I don't love them. Let's go. You ready? You ready to be my personal photographer? Yeah. There you go. This is the kind of like little TV that when we were on long car rides, my dad made a thing to put it in the back of the car so we could watch little DVDs on the little DVD player in the back of the car on long car rides because such things as TVs in built into the seats, I don't think was invented yet. We had the exact same thing. Yeah. We've talked about this before, I think. Yeah. It was kind of like that TV. Yep, but just all black. All, yeah, all black and it had like a DVD spot in it, which is why we could like take our folder of DVDs to watch movies in the car. Yeah, we took our N64 with us and our Ooh. PlayStation. Oh, <coughs> I also had my dad's really old Game Boy. Or what's the, just the classic Nintendo Game Boy. Yeah. It's like gray. Yeah. We had that with the little, little games and stuff too. And we played that a lot. So much that it just ran at like the screen kind of ran out like you couldn't really like, see it anymore. It faded until you couldn't see it anymore. Crazy. What's next? Oh, it's so big. Um, There's a button. Push the red button. Do you push the button? Are we on an episode of Taskmaster? Should I push the button? Mm -hmm. You can push the button? <laughs> no. No button. Then why is it there? I don't know. <gasps> wow. We're passing the space station. It's so blue. Now this would win you the Twinkle Tour competition when you're decorating your house for Christmas. This blow up would really win that competition. <laughs> it's so blue. This exhibit was 500 times better than the sci fi author one that we went to first. around you. Really? Look at the floor. We just got put in the elevator. I don't know what's happening. Is this the start of sleep no more? What's going on? Did we click the right number? This is gonna be a cool picture. Every turn, this place just keeps getting bigger and bigger. This is like an entire like team lab exhibition. Yeah. I thought it was just gonna be like two rooms. Oh, this is Spot Tweets. I got the stamp from Spot too. I got this thing. That's so cool. 20 centimeters above. Oh, look. Choose your own.
own destination. Woshashe? Who am I? Wotainar? Where am I? This one's a bit harder. <laughs> Is that Yao? Wo Yao Chu? We didn't pass the test. Where am I going? Yeah, it's where am I going? We're in the astronaut's head. This is from Wait, the beginning. Look, 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 look. She's gonna come take a picture. Her friend, oh, I guess they're standing below us. They're taking a picture of us, but we are the astronaut. I, this has to be, is it real time? I think so. I think so. Oh my god. It's so fun. People were watching us from space when maybe we were not. there. We'll see. We haven't run into anyone else here, so maybe not. Well, we've seen them. Girl in pink dress. Go explore. Lauren, I found an anomaly in the matrix. What? A mouse. Oh my god. <laughs> the mouse. <laughs> we're back in the elevator. I don't know if we're meant to do this or not. I don't know. We're going up. Yeah, there was no one here. But there was someone there when we were looking to go out or in. Okay, we're going up. Are we meant to? Will this be something? Oh. Oh. Yeah. It is something. This was such a choose your own adventure. This was quite epic, especially because I was not expecting really like anything like this. And that's why it was like so surprising. You know, when we went to Team Labs, we like fully expected it. Like we knew it was like insane. But this is so cool. And yeah, we do love interactive art exhibits. Whoa, there's a show happening in there. <gasps> that looks cool, doesn't it? Yeah. <gasps> I wanna go. Today? Whoa. We randomly found ourselves in the middle of China Fashion Week. And are we famous? Or do we just look cute today? I think anyone looking at me would realize immediately that these shorts are from Zara, so. The funny part is, as soon as I pointed this camera at you, and now there's people three other cameras something. got pointed at us. Will I find myself on Red Book later? It's possible. It's possible. <laughs> I'm gonna end the video here at our favorite little local restaurant with my best friend Earl, who's here with us. Hi Earl. I'm gonna give you a little taste of the vibe of our favorite local restaurant. You can listen to the sounds, take in the ambience, see what you think. The ambiance. See what you think. Earl knows that he is the star of this clip. Eating some of our favorite local food, we've got the cauliflower and the meat dish. And we're waiting for my favorite beans and Alex's favorite skewers. Finishing off a nice weekend and then back to work tomorrow. So we'll see you again next week. Thanks for watching. Bye.